Deep within the intricate framework of the International Space Station ISS lies a critical component that serves as the backbone of its functionality. This central hub is responsible for power generation and thermal management ensuring the station's sustainability and operational capabilities. Moreover, the central hub houses power conversion units and energy storage systems. This comprehensive integration of power generation, thermal regulation and energy storage within this core component ensures the ISS sustained operation and enables continued advancement in space exploration and scientific discovery. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, we'll see about the fifth module of the ISS, the P6 truss segment. Let's start the video. The P6 truss segment. The P6 truss segment is a pivotal component of the International Space Station ISS, serving as a hub for essential systems crucial for its functionality in space. It is primarily responsible for power generation and thermal management, ensuring the station's sustainability and operational capabilities. Through advanced solar panel arrays, the P6 truss segment harnesses solar energy to provide electricity for various onboard systems and experiments powering the ISS's scientific research endeavors and life support systems. Additionally, the segment incorporates sophisticated thermal control mechanisms including radiators and heat dissipation systems to regulate the station's internal temperature and prevent overheating. This comprehensive integration of power generation, thermal regulation, and energy storage within the P6 truss segment ensures the ISS is sustained operation and enables continued advancements in space exploration and scientific discovery. Manufacturing The International Space Station ISS's P6 truss segment is a testament to global cooperation in space exploration with various components built by different space agencies and contractors. The sonar panels, crucial for power generation, were constructed by a team led by Lockheed Martin for NASA. These panels convert sunlight into electricity, powering the ISS's operations and scientific research. The thermal control radiators are responsible for managing heat dissipation were developed by Boeing, another key contractor for NASA. These radiators play a vital role in regulating the station's internal temperature in the vacuum of space. Finally, the batteries. The NIH2 batteries in the P6 truss were primarily manufactured by Eagle Fisher Technologies based in Rhode Island, USA. The NIH2 batteries were replaced in later missions by more advanced lithium ion batteries which were supplied by JS USA based in Kyoto, Japan. The P6 truss segment was a crucial component of the International Space Station ISS. Launched aboard Spatial Endeavour STS-97 on November 30, 2000 at 7.04 pm Eastern Standard Time. Spatial Endeavour lifted off from Kennedy Space Center Launch Complex 39B in Florida embarking on its mission to deliver the P6 truss to the ISS. Docking of the P6 truss segment Docking of STS-97 The STS-97 mission, which included the assembly of the P6 truss segment, docked with the International Space Station ISS using the Space Shuttle Endeavour. Endeavour docked with the ISS at the Unity Module's Pressurized Mating Adapter 3 
पीएमए थ्री डॉकिंग पोल अटैचमेंट ऑफ द पी सिक्स ट्रस्ट सेगमेंट The assembly of the P6 truss segment involved a series of space walks and robotic operations. The installation process included the use of the shuttle remote manipulator system, commonly known as a robotic arm or Canada arm, to maneuver the P6 truss into position for attachment to the top of the Z1 truss. Departure and landing. The installation of the P6 truss segment was completed, and the space shuttle Endeavour undocked from the ISS on December 9, 2000. The entire mission, from launch to landing, lasted approximately 11 days, 19 hours, and 20 minutes. With Endeavour landing back at Kennedy Space Center on December 11, 2000, successfully completing its task in assembling the P6 truss segment and contributing to the ongoing construction of the International Space Station. parts and elements of the p6 truss segment solar panels the p6 truss segment of the iss includes two solar arrays each consisting of solar panels these panels are responsible for converting sunlight into electricity using photovoltaic cells this electricity powers various systems and experiments aboard the iss thermal control radiators thermal control radiators are responsible for dissipating excess heat generated by various systems on the iss including the solar panels thermal control radiators are responsible for dissipating excess heat generated by various systems on the iss these radiators use a vacuum of space to radiate heat away helping to regulate the temperature inside the station stored photovoltaic radiators these radiators are part of the thermal control systems and are specifically designed to dissipate heat generated by the solar panels themselves as the solar panels operate they generate heat and the stored photovoltaic radiators help in dissipating this heat to maintain optimal operating temperatures for solar panels and other systems power conversion system dc to dc conversion unit ddcu the power generated by the solar panels is in direct current dc form the dc to dc conversion units are part of the power conversion system that converts a dc power into the various voltages needed by the different systems on the iss they regulate and 
distribute electrical power efficiently throughout the station. Batteries Batteries are crucial for storing electrical energy on the ISS, especially during orbital night periods when solar power is not available. The batteries in the P6 truss segment store excess power generated by the solar panels during daylight for use when the station is in the Earth's shadow. In conclusion, the P6 truss segment stands as a remarkable testament to human ingenuity and collaboration in space exploration. Through a combination of innovative engineering and international cooperation, this crucial component has significantly enhanced the capabilities of the International Space Station ISS. Its solar panels provide essential power where its thermal control systems ensure the station's proper functioning in the harsh environment of space. The assembly and integration of the P6 truss as showcased in this video highlight the dedication and expertise of the teams involved in constructing and maintaining the ISS. This achievement not only furthers our understanding of space but also serves as a beacon of inspiration for future exploration endeavors showcasing what humanity can achieve when they work together towards common goals in the vastness of space. I hope this video on the P6 truss segment was interesting. I'll meet you in the next video with another interesting topic. Take care. Bye.